here and today I'm doing another slime challenge. So I think this is slime challenge part two. And one of my fans has requested that I do an Arizona green tea slime. As you guys can see right there. So I accepted this challenge and I have many more challenges coming up. So I accepted this challenge and I'm going to be trying to see if this Arizona green tea will make a slime. So I have my popsicle sticks right there. I have my friends right here. And I'm just going to be using the recipe I always use. And in the links in the description, I will put the original recipe plus the slime challenge before this one. So just to let you guys know, I'm going to start off with a little bit of some glue in this bowl. I'm only using a tiny bit because I don't want to waste a lot so that if it works, I, have, I can just make more. And if it doesn't, all that glue will go to waste. So I'm going to use about that much, which was about a tablespoon or a teaspoon. Grab a popsicle stick and make sure our green tea is all well incorporated. I think this slime will be clear because this drink, in fact, doesn't have much of a color. It has a bit of a foggy color. I don't know if you guys can see that. So it doesn't have much color to it. It's not going to be like our Starbucks coffee slime, which was brown. Whoopsies. <gasps> camera, come on. Almost got slime all over that camera, but you know. Pour in some baking soda. And come on now. Two sides. Goodness, I gotta wipe you guys off with some booty paper. There we go. All right, so we're gonna grab a new popsicle stick and mix it in. And the baking soda actually lumped up because I didn't mix it for a while. So I'm gonna well, well, well incorporate this and clean up as I go. All right, so I'm gonna add about a tea or a tablespoon at a time of my solution and mix. So what do you know guys, it's working and I won't keep this for very long because it will start to mold because it has sugar in it. And you don't want moldy slime, do you? So I'm pretty sure this has sugar, let's check. It has 70 grams of sugar, so yeah, it will mold if you leave it for a while, which I will not be doing. My favorite part is squirting the solution into the slime because it goes everywhere. Oops, it's very sticky. Since this is not an original slime without like any sticky sugar drinks in it, it is going to be sticky, so you're going to need a little bit more solution than an original recipe without this drink in it. Alright, so I'm going to set that aside right there and pour some solution on my table. Make sure not to wet these little guys. Okay, now take out the slime and place it right there. Remove from the popsicle stick and just fiddle around with it for a little bit. And make sure it keeps getting in the solution. And just keep on eating it until the slime has fully absorbed all of that solution. So like that it won't be so sticky. And if you're storing this in a container, make sure you wet the container with solution in it. Or if you're using a bag, anything will store it. As long as it's airtight. Okay, so here we have our amazing slime. I actually really like this slime. It's really, really fascinating. So, since this is a clear glue slime, when I stretch it, it's like a mirror. So you can literally see everything through the slime. Like if you stretch it, it's like a little mirror. So hope you guys enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe to become an official minion, and peace. Don't forget, if you have any challenges, let me know down below. Bye.